In this video, I'm going to show you how you can place the checkout form for any product, for a specific product, anywhere on your website. So here I am inside of the test product. I'm going to come down to the checkout settings right here, and you'll see a checkout form shortcode. So if you copy and paste this, you can put it anywhere you want. You can put it inside of a page, in a specific spot of a page. So when somebody goes to that page URL, the form would appear. You can put it inside of a blog post. You can put it on a page, a course page. You can put it anywhere that you want that's not necessarily a page. So up here you have the custom checkout page, which are all the pages you can choose from. But again, you can now utilize this short code and put it anywhere you want for the form to appear. So an example is let's just go to a blog post. If we add a new blog post, so post for test product, now let's just add some fake text, and then maybe we want the checkout form at the bottom, let's even just put an image at the top, So here's our blog post. Let's go ahead and hit publish. And now you'll see when we view the blog post, our checkout form is right here. So the person can a good, a good example is, you know, if you have a if you have a blog post and you want to try to capture their information to purchase a product or a service from you directly after the blog post and not necessarily send them away to a different page, you can embed the checkout form right at the bottom or anywhere you want inside of the blog post. Another good example would be if you're offering a free product or service, you can embed your free product or service registration form or checkout form into the blog post as well as a lead generation opportunity. So now you have the opportunity to place the checkout form for any product you have using the checkout form shortcode located at the checkout settings tab. If you have any questions, let us know. Thanks.